and we're gonna head over to uh, the farm and we're gonna get lots and lots of hay today. The farmy warmy. We're gonna have a long day probably. There's chupacabras at the farm that nobody got a big big surprise. I tell you. I'm gonna stack them at full power. Full. All right. Uh, Laramie Larry gave us some bad bills, so well, we're absolutely loaded up right now. That's a chupacabra. And it's All right, grand rising, mother buckers. Grand rising. Back at it again with another video. We're going to walk all around the corner, not show the street, and get a uh, trailer hooked up. And we're gonna head over to uh, the farm, and we're gonna get lots and lots of hay today. The farmy warmy. We're gonna have a long day probably because a lot of stops. So we'll see how it goes, guys. We'll keep you uh, updated along the journey. Here you are. I probably need to pull forward a little bit and just Correct hitch, it. It, hitch it to the right. All right, guys, let's get it hitched up. He's warming up the rig. Woo! All right, mother buckers, I got a big, big surprise. I tell you what. Legendary protein chips. Some ranch Dorito legendaries with oh. 20 grams of protein. Oh my goodness. This uh, is going to be insane, guys. looks like an insane one. I just went with the usual I got stick and a seat roll. And I'm, I'm just curious. What's this about? I bet they're going to be good. It smells like a Dorito. This is going to taste like a really crunchy Dorito. That's what I think. Probably got like extra protein powders in there. Does it taste pretty righteous? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like a pop chip. Yeah, it's good. Mmm, very good guys. Wow. I'm give it a test taste. I'm absolutely loving that. It tastes like a Cool Ranch Dorito. This is awesome. I love this, guys. All right, guys, we're going to go to the farm now. We'll see you when we get there. All right, guys, we just made it to the farm. We're getting the trailer all loaded up. All right, we're going to get some cow hay put on there right now, and then uh, we're yep. going to go do our first delivery of the day. Yup. We're going to go get the 28 cow bailis. Yeah, Cal Bayless nice and is heavy. still sick somehow. It's because he's uh, detoxing. I don't understand it, guys. I'm not loving it. This guy's been taking herbs. He's getting detoxification of the liver. Yep, my herbs are kicking in full force, full power. Extra mucus release. <sighs> well, yeah, guys, we're going to get this cow hay, go right down the road and deliver that, and then we'll come back and get loaded up for our other deliveries. Yep. Yep. All right, guys. Guys, Carson is really just going straight in on his chips. It's like 8 a.m. 8 a.m. It's gonna hit the cool ranch. It's like ah. the it's like the the people in middle school that would be having hot Cheetos first thing in the morning. Um, hot yeah. Cheetos in a 44 ounce, but instead he went for the pro protein and tea version. <laughs> so we're because I'm white. Yeah, we're dialed, guys. We're dialed. Uh, Larry is definitely taking his sweet time to come help us get this hay loaded. Yeah, we need it loaded now. He probably, probably uh, lost his boots. He's probably looking for him. Probably got a snake in his boots. Yeah, Larry, i seen Larry take off his boots and leave them sitting open. That's like the number one cowboy rule. You never leave your boots sitting out in the open. That's Makes how you get want it. to take a poopity doopity that's how in them. Yeah, <laughs> Carson wants to poop in them. But I think that's how you get a snake in your boot, like the classic well, saying. I'll, I'll drop a snake in his boot right out well, my butt. It's like comes from those times when the cowboys would like sleep on the ground next to their horse at night, and then they take off their boots and they wake up and put their boots on, and there's a snake in the boot because the snakes get cold at night, so they're looking for something to live in. A hidey hole. A hidey hole. So never, never, never. never polish them off. Polish them off. Never leave your boots unattended, guys, and you'll be okay. Keep them on your feet all day long. Otherwise, you won't make it. So be careful.
guys are enjoying this video. Be sure to like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more videos. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Alright guys, pulling in, backing into our stop. Woo! This stuff right over here. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm loving this. Guys, I'm still a little out of breath. We just did that real fast. We did it very quickly, guys. Real fast, because we got we got a lot of stops. Tell he wants to get done with the day. Now, Let's get this. We're doing things in a timely fashion today. We're gonna be extra efficient. I'm gonna stack them in full power. <clears throat> full power, power, full strength. Need I say more? You feel me? Go, go, motherfuckers, unite! Best believe it. Best believe it. Best believe it. All right, guys, we're back at the farm setting up our another load. I need a tissue, guys. I got an issue. Yeah, I have an issue, and you need your tissue. Use your glove. I blow my nose in my hands. No, blow it in one of your dirty jackets. Ah. Or a piece of paper. Uh. Or a ratchet strap. <laughs> there we go. Hey, hey! <laughs> he was trying to blow his nose on my jacket. Here, I think this will. I think this will work. A little, That's what we use to cover up the fuel line. A cow pie diesel rag that still smells incredibly strong like diesel. Does it really? Oh. Man. Oh man. All right. Getting the load on the trailer. Larry did that one perfect. Thank you, Larry. Thank you, Larry. All right, just a couple more bales, guys, and we'll be on our way to the top. If you guys want to be mother buckers like us, go to motherbuckers47.com and get yourself a mother bucking shirt. Link in the description. Just getting three more alfalfa bales, then we'll be all set to hit the road. We got quite a few bales on there today, guys. Back up, 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 stop. Good to go, guys. Let's put these three bales on and tie them down. We'll hit the road. Bring you guys along for the journey. I think we just went gone pro. I think we just gone pro, guys. Gone pro on a trolley wally. Yep, look at this. All right, guys. <laughs> Boom. Oh guys, there's a I don't know what that is. <laughs> but here it is. Oh, I'm gonna eat it guys. I'm gonna cook it up. Should we meat. roast it up like a chicken nugget? It's still got its teeth. Yeah. Somebody got chopped in half yeah, really that thing bad. Would buck you. That That's thing pretty would, sad, honestly. That thing would bite you with its buckers. I don't even know what that was. It's like a mole. That's a it's a guys. it's a ground mole, guys. guys. That's a chupacabra in its first formation. Yeah guys, it's a secret. There's chupacabras at the farm that nobody will tell the truth about, guys. Nobody will talk about it. But one day we're gonna catch it on film and we'll, that's when we'll go viral, guys. It's like catching the squanch, the sasquanch. Or the Loch Ness Monster of Morana. We're gonna keep that on the Trilly Whaley to try and attract it and trap it, guys. Yeah, we're gonna track the scent tonight. Tonight, we're gonna kiss it. We're gonna rub this blood on our face like war paint and catch the chupacabra. Chupacabra. Alright guys, 
Uh, I can't breathe, guys. Just stacked in a barn, some Bermuda. Oh, we didn't even film it because that's an interesting stop. So it's not really, it's not really the right vibes for recording. No, it really isn't. But no, but we did it. We did what we had to do. But man, it's in like a big garage, and it's really like smooth concrete in there. So it just dust up the Bermuda really bad, and I just breathing it in, guys. Not good, guys. <laughs> But I'll recover by the time we make it to our next stop. So we'll see you there. All right, guys. So we pulled up at our last stop a second ago, and uh, we were it's starting to unload the hay. Oh, this will work. We were starting to unload the hay, and then we realized that there was some bad bales in there. Turns out Laramie Larry gave us some bad bales. So what we're gonna do now is unload for what would have been our last stop, and we're gonna go back to the farm. Okay, how many more bales? Seven. Seven more bales and then deliver them and then we'll be done for the day, guys. <laughs> Let's get these ones stacked in this little trailer, though. Too. Getting gas, guys. That should have been it for the day if Larry, Larry would have gave us some good hay. We've already been done right now. Right now. Cool. But now I gotta go get seven more bailiffs and then get that done real quick. Real quick. Oh, what's really going on? He's in an absolute spin out. Swing it back there, back in. All right, guys, we're gonna head to the farm one more time. Guys, we have some trolley wallies. What's really going on, guys? What's really going on? They thought they could scoot up. Beyond the weight limit. Beyond the 26,000 pounds. But at the end of the day, seven bales is going to be very, very difficult. Difficult, 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 <laughs> difficult. This is bad, guys. I only have a little bit of glacier rain left. <laughs> yeah, about half of it. But <laughs> Man, don't be the water, bro. You got to be careful. Oh, my. He's going to drown. All right, guys. We're just going to uh. go ahead and... Uh, we're gonna deliver these seven bales and call it a day. We'll see you there. All right, guys, let's offload this hay. I tell you what. Uh oh. Carpy's gonna really have to swing this one. Oh no. What's really going on? Oh, he's got it. You're saving it, bud. You're good. Oh yeah. Oh, we're dialed. Maybe one more hitch on it so that way we don't crash out. Alright, here it comes. Oh yeah. We're dying. Hey, real quick. All right, mother buckers. 
Here we are at our final destination. the guys. We got 15 Bailey Whaley's in here now. Customers. Let's outro guys. Let's outro guys. Our day is done. Our day is all gone. Thank you for watching our videos. Yep. Thanks for watching guys. Please be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And uh, stay tuned for future videos. Check out motherbuckers47.com. That's like carpet shirt under his flannel. You Check could be it just out. as cool as us. You could be a mother bucker too, guys. Check it out. Mother buckers. And I still have my participation sticker from the parade. Be sure to check out that video on our Facebook at TucsonHay.com. All right, mother buckers, we're out. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.